California's ambitious high-speed rail project continues to make substantial progress in 2024, with numerous milestones achieved and significant developments underway. This video provides an in-depth look at the current state of the project, its achievements, challenges, and the road ahead. Key milestones and construction progress, grade separations and overcrossings. In 2024, the California High Speed Rail Authority announced the completion of two significant grade separations in Fresno County, the Mountain View Avenue and Floral Avenue overcrossings. These structures, built by the Dragados Flatiron Joint Venture, are crucial for improving safety by eliminating at-grade crossings and facilitating smoother traffic flow over future high-speed rail tracks. The Mountain View Avenue grade separation, measuring 368 feet in length and 40 feet in width, required 16,000 cubic yards of concrete and over 4,000 pounds of steel. Similarly, the Floral Avenue grade separation is 381 feet long and involves substantial material use. These projects represent vital infrastructure upgrades that are essential for the safe and efficient operation of high-speed rail in the region. The completion of these overcrossings is a testament to the collaborative efforts of various stakeholders, including local governments, contractors, and the community. These structures not only enhance safety, but also contribute to reducing traffic congestion and greenhouse gas emissions from idling vehicles. The project's emphasis on sustainability and community safety reflects California's broader goals of environmental stewardship and infrastructure modernization. As the project progresses, more such structures are expected to be completed, further paving the way for a seamless high-speed rail network across the state. Central Valley Progress Construction in the Central Valley is advancing rapidly with more than 25 active construction sites. Highlights include the ongoing work on the Hanford Viaduct, the largest construction site in the Central Valley system. This viaduct, located in Kings County, will play a crucial role in connecting electrified high-speed trains to the future Kings slash Tulare station. Other major projects include the Belmont Avenue Great Separation, Tide Arch Bridge in Fresno County, and the Tool River Viaduct in Tulare County. Each of these projects represents a critical component of the overall high-speed rail network, ensuring connectivity and efficiency. The Hanford Viaduct, for instance, is a massive structure that will support the high-speed rail tracks and ensure smooth travel over a considerable distance. Similarly, the Tide Arch Bridge in Fresno County is an architectural marvel that showcases the project's innovative design and engineering capabilities. The Tool River Viaduct is another significant structure that highlights the extensive planning and construction efforts involved in the high-speed rail project. Together, these projects illustrate the scale and ambition of California's high-speed rail initiative, which aims to transform the state's transportation landscape. Job creation and economic impact. Since the inception of the high-speed rail project, over 13,000 construction jobs have been created, predominantly benefiting residents of the Central Valley. This includes significant employment in Fresno, Kern, Tulare, Madera, Kings, and Merced counties. The project's economic impact extends beyond job creation, contributing billions in economic output and labor income. Local businesses and suppliers have also benefited from the increased demand for materials and services, further boosting the regional economy. The job creation aspect of the high-speed rail project is particularly noteworthy as it provides stable, well-paying jobs in regions that have historically faced economic challenges. The influx of employment opportunities has revitalized local economies, leading to improved living standards and increased economic activity. Furthermore, the project has prioritized hiring local workers, ensuring that the benefits of construction are felt directly by the communities most affected by the development. As construction continues, the number of jobs is expected to rise, creating even more opportunities for local residents and businesses. Design and Future Operations Track and Overhead Electrical Systems In June 2024, California High Speed Rail Authority approved the contract for the design of track and overhead electrical systems for the initial 171-mile segment connecting Merce to Bakersfield. This contract, awarded to the joint venture Sistrite and Type A, marks a critical step towards the operation of electrified high-speed trains. The contract, 
valued at up to $131.2 million, includes producing high-level designs for track and overhead contact systems, managing technical interfaces, and ensuring the seamless integration of various project components. This design phase is crucial as it lays the groundwork for the construction of the track and electrical systems, which are integral to the functioning of high-speed rail. The focus on advanced design and technology will enable the California high-speed rail system to achieve top speeds of 220 miles per hour, significantly reducing travel times between key destinations. Station Design and Community Engagement the design of Central Valley stations is progressing with ongoing community input sessions to ensure the designs meet local needs and preferences. The authority is also making strides in designing train interiors and other necessary infrastructure. These community engagement efforts are crucial for building public support and ensuring that the stations reflect the unique characteristics and requirements of the regions they serve. Engaging with the community allows the project planners to gather valuable feedback and incorporate local insights into the station designs. This collaborative approach helps in creating stations that are not only functional, but also resonate with the local population. Additionally, these sessions help in addressing any concerns or suggestions from the community, fostering a sense of ownership and pride in the project. The station designs aim to provide a seamless and comfortable experience for passengers with modern amenities and efficient layouts that facilitate easy movement and access. Environmental Clearances The authority has successfully completed environmental clearances for 422 miles of the high-speed rail program, extending from the Bay Area to Los Angeles County. This clearance is a vital prerequisite for future construction and operational phases, the rigorous environmental review process ensures that the project complies with all state and federal regulations, minimizing its impact on the environment while promoting sustainability. Achieving environmental clearance is a significant milestone that reflects the project's commitment to environmental stewardship. The thorough review process includes assessing the potential impacts on local ecosystems, wildlife, and communities, and implementing measures to mitigate any adverse effects. This commitment to sustainability is aligned with California's broader goals of reducing greenhouse gas emissions and promoting clean energy. The environmental clearances pave the way for future construction activities, ensuring that the project progresses smoothly and responsibly. Funding and Financial Aspects Federal Support and Funding The federal government has significantly invested in the California High Speed Rail Project, including over $3.3 billion in new grant funding awarded in 2023. These funds are essential for advancing the work on the initial operating segment and supporting future extensions. The substantial federal support underscores the project's national importance and its potential to serve as a model for high-speed rail development in the United States. The influx of federal funding provides a financial backbone for the project enabling the California High-Speed Rail Authority to undertake large-scale construction activities and procure essential materials and services. This support also enhances the project's credibility, attracting additional investments and partnerships. The federal government's commitment highlights the strategic importance of high-speed rail in transforming transportation infrastructure and promoting economic growth. Business Plan and Financial Management the 2024 business plan outlines the project's financial strategies, including risk management, funding forecasts, and estimates. The plan highlights the importance of maintaining accountability and ensuring the project stays on budget and on schedule. The comprehensive financial management approach is designed to address potential challenges and ensure the project's long-term viability. The business plan serves as a roadmap for the project's financial and operational strategies, detailing how funds will be allocated and managed. It includes rigorous risk management protocols to identify and mitigate potential financial risks, ensuring that the project remains financially sustainable. The plan also outlines various funding sources, including federal grants, state funds, and private investments, providing a diversified financial base. By maintaining strict financial discipline and transparency, the California High-Speed Rail Authority aims to build trust and confidence among stakeholders and the public.
That's all for today's video. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. For more updates on transformative infrastructure projects and other insightful content, 